for you. I want to pray with some people here. Who are very much uh, worried. Before I call an altar call to so Jesus. Uh, maybe because of serious problems there. You can come and stand here. Let me stop there, sister. Let me hear your problem. Please stop there, all of you. Let me get one message. Everybody is worrying here. I can see. So, but let's get few people. Uh -huh. My father was beaten by stroke. The husband left me with children. The husband left you with children? Yes. Before the husband... Uh, the husband leave you with children. Were you worrying about Papa? I was worried about my father, but she was, he was not yet. They just said he has got sugar diabetes. So, when did your husband left you with children? No, now when I family. Ufamba abu ya sometimes ufamba viki sometimes two days. We go for a week sometimes two days. Muna wakona ule kui sometimes we are kept town sometimes vaya hotel akwana. Sometimes we just go to hotels around. Yes. We are still together. Yes. Because loka abu ya wa apologize. When he comes back he will apologize. And things will go right but after some time he will do it again. How many children do you have with him? Two. 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 Yes. Mm. So you still want your husband? Too much. Yes. I don't want to leave him. I will tell you something that I'm not talking about your husband, but sometimes you must know that the problem, we are the ones who create them. If now you love someone, I wanted to say this thing, but maybe you won't understand if I say it. There's no lady. There's, there's no woman who's able to love a man. So I wanted to tell you something like that. That is why, that is why all the time you find it's a man we have to start you. That is why to love there's no woman. You know, the love of a woman to the man is the response respond of the love you are giving. So a woman cannot first love. You first love, you will be manipulated. If you just look at the man, you begin to love that man. That man come to you. It's possible the same man will manipulate you. It, it, it's not spiritual. You are, you are making mistakes. You, you have created your own husband. It must be like this. It must be like this. And you find why he comes to you. It's not even spiritual. It's something that you must know. You were supposed to be approached by three or four lady men. And now you go and pray and ask them, which one is the one God. And God will direct you. But now if you see that like this, you say, yeah, this man, if he comes to me, I will agree. Don't ever think you are alone on that. There might be five who are saying the same thing you are saying. So this is the results that you are going through now. And from there, once the man is there now, he, he compels you with others. When, when he goes out, sometimes ask your, your husband, why do you love me? If you say you are beautiful, don't ever think you are more beautiful than the whole world. I don't know if you are hearing that. Amen. So I, I think... Uh, that's what I can guide my sister. I don't think you are... If this thing carry on this way, you, you can end up not being married. You understand what I'm trying to say? 
So you must reach a level where you free yourself and seek God. Like what you are saying. Now. But if you say, I love him so much. I love him so much. I love him so much. He, can you see what he's doing, this man? He knows you love him so much. And you are not alone. And that is why you are going to get this problem, you never solve it. Okay, you can still love him so much because you are good children. With him. Maybe. That he doesn't have other children somewhere. No. Eh? no. So he married you. Did he pay the water? Yes. Okay, lift up your hands. I release you today. I deliver this man. And I deliver you in Jesus' name. Take it in the name of Jesus Christ. You are free. I didn't pray for your father. I pray for your marriage. So another one. Stop there. Let's hear this one. Oh, there's another one there. Come to this one also. Okay, I, I'm worried about my family. Like in the family, we are facing a limitation. Like nothing is moving in the family. No one like is working a better job. Are you educated, you people? No, we are not. So there are some things that we don't need to worry. I'm not educated. I'm she, I mean, there are some things we are praying for in the church. You're not educated. You don't have a, a degree. Do you have a degree? No. You pass metric? Yes. So what kind of job can you get in metric? Is it a, a job that you can get 10,000 rand? 20,000 rand? What? Sometimes you people here, we need to tell you that, okay? Like him, he says the whole family is like this. So now you look at yourself, okay? If there's a stagnation in the family, what is stopping the family? I mean, if you know that I'm not educated, no one is educated, no one, what do you worry? You're not educated, you people. All of you, you can go to work in the farms, you can do this and then you can get small money. Why do you worry? Why don't you thank God so that God will give you wisdom? When he gives you wisdom now, you are able to study. With what you are doing, God can couple with what you are doing and prosper you. I'm trying to say, you don't need to, to worry about what you cannot change. I'm sure you hear what I'm trying to say. I mean, how can... How, for example, look here. I'm a husband of Eunice. I cannot be your husband, isn't it? So why do you worry that I'm the husband of Eunice? I'm sure I understand what I'm trying to say. I will never be your husband, even if you pray and fast 90 days. Because I'm a husband of what? Of it. So you now, you say, the question of why this man like this one, I want a man like this one. You go, oh, okay. And why are my families like this? Okay, let me try to seek God. But not worry. Because if you see God worrying again, you will find you are seeking. Okay, let me stop worrying and I seek God. You understand? When in the process of seeking God, God will direct you to the right husband. But if you just worry, hey, I'm worried, I'm worried, we can't get jobs, whatever, whatever, whatever. There's nothing that God can do. Because on the other hand, you are worried. Tomorrow you want to do business, here you want a job, this, that. God can't give you anything. But if you seek God, are you hearing my brother? I don't want to pray for you. Are you hearing me? Amen. Yes. You need just to seek God and become a Christian. Are you a Christian? Yes, I'm a Christian. From when? From Ivory Park. From when? Oh, from last year, to September, yeah, somewhere there. You were not drinking? I was drinking, I was smoking cigarettes and weed, yes. And uh, you are no longer drinking? I'm no longer drinking, I'm no longer smoking. From when? Since uh, last year, October, last, November, December. Last, last year, it's not a far away, like, far away from, I mean, I, this is last year, October, November, November, beginning of December, you were not drinking. Yes, I wasn't. Eh? I wasn't so, drinking. So, December, January. I wasn't. Now, even now, you're yes. not drinking. We are February now. 
You've got two months without drinking. What if God can bless you before you find him, his ways? It's possible that you can do chisanyama and drinking. So what you have to do, I'm guiding you, is you, you need to seek God now. Amen. How do you seek God? You know, you say, I know my family is like this, but I want God. And then with righteousness, you live for God. God will guide you. There's nobody who's born to be empty. God will take you to your destiny, and you can be a savior of the family. Amen. God bless you. Amen. Let's get the last one. Sister? I'm just worried for my family. I'm fighting every time with my husband, so... You and your husband, you're fighting? Yes. And you don't know the cause? Yeah, most of the pastors, they are coming. We are going to the police station. They arrest him. He's coming back. You fight him, you make him to be arrested? Yeah. You are the one making him to be arrested? Yes. Where's your mom? It's in Ethiopia. Huh? In Ethiopia. Because this thing is from your family. You people, you don't marry. You have problems. Yeah, I know. Huh? You don't marry. When you get a man, you sit on top of a man. Now, this man, when he sees that you sit on top, begin to beat you up and do whatever. Yeah. You start by disrespecting. So, we need to cast this spirit from you. Amen. And you set the family free. Amen. You understand? Yeah. So therefore, this is the spirit of the family that is also affecting you. Even yourself, you can fight it by following God. You understand? By really following God. So that all these branches you got from the family will be cut off. You hear me? Yeah. I'll pray for you. Okay. In Jesus' name. God, you demon. <laughs> The demon of the family. Out! Can you just get the last one? What's happening, Mama? I'm worrying because of the sickness in my body. Sickness in the body? Yes. What is happening, Mama, concerning sickness? My body is shivering, heaviness at the back, no appetite. My mouth is bitterness. When you go to the doctor, what is the doctor saying? The doctor said they don't see anything. And uh, you go to the doctor, the doctor says you don't see anything. Yes. Mama, you went to which doctor who cannot see anything? Which doctor? Special, I was from specialist. You say you can't see anything? Yes. Ah. Doctor told you you can't see anything. He gave you medication. Tablets. Mm. Yeah, that is for what? Just for blood pressure. Hmm. So are you a Christian? Yes, I'm a Christian. From which church? Well of Life. Word of Life. Mm. Word of Life. Word of Life. I will pray for you. I want to pray for you so that what happened to your forefather must not come to you. Amen. This, this spirit of ancestral spirit that is in you must leave you. Amen. It's also affecting your feet. Yes. You yes. also have problem with your feet here. Yes. Huh? Touch your chest. You'll be free. In Jesus' name. A mic in her mouth. I want to hear this sound. What are you doing to her? Many people, when we pray for them, they fall. Don't ever think it's over. You know, Satan works in a very stupid way.